The mayor of Ripley, Tennessee, clearing up confusion tonight after tenants of Rolling Hills and Ripley Terrace apartment complexes got a letter from property owners telling them to vacate immediately. Good evening to you. I'm Joy Redmond. And I'm Joe Birch. Action News 5's Tavarius Haywood spoke with the mayor of Ripley, who says the property owners are not keeping up their end of the deal. Tavarius? Yeah, that's right. Ripley Mayor Craig Fitzhugh says both apartments, Rolling Hills and Ripley Terrace, are desperate in, in desperate needs of repairs. He says the problem comes in when trying to fix the problems while tenants are living there. Tenants from Rolling Hills and Ripley Terrace got this notice last Friday from the property owners, Hallmark Companies, to leave immediately. Ripley Mayor Craig Fitzhugh says the repairs to both complexes are impossible to fix while tenants are there. We suggested there are a lot of vacant units. We suggested, frankly, that, hey, why don't you fix the vacant units up, move the folks over, and, 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 and they didn't like that idea. I spoke with the regional director for Hallmark Companies, Candy Jones. The company cites a stop work order from the city of Ripley, which Fitzhugh says the city did issue. But he says it's because the property owners are not sticking to what they agreed to. The management company has taken it upon itself to tell these people that the city said they've got to leave, and that's just not true. We're working with them. We have we have plans to to rehab those apartments, but they're they're not in shape for anybody to live right now. So that's that's our concern uh, to get them done as quickly as possible uh, and not throw people out on the street. Many residents told us they've been complaining about issues for years, from leaking ceilings, busted lights, and even mildew. Jones said the stop work order is preventing them from making things right. There is no court order. This is just our building inspector who has has doing his job and said and has confirmed it by the fire marshal that the building is not fit for, you know, until they unless they do some rehab. Well, as it stands, Mayor Fritzhugh says tenants do not have to leave because there is no court order and they do not plan to take this to court. He says the city intends to make the complexes a safe place to live that follows the law. The next city meeting is June 5th and they plan to discuss what will happen next. Tavarius Haywood, Action News 5.